Hello everybody, this is Jay Sims Plays and welcome to another neighbour video. So this is my neighbour True Simmer. So we go into her front door and it walk into sort of a bedroom, I don't know. It's got like a bed and a sofa and stuff and a chair and it's also got these tiny little rooms that uh, hasn't got anything in them and of course it's got my Simmer, another Sim in there. And it's got a lift as well. So look all around it's got uh, in the garden it's got uh, some placed plants and stuff and she's made use of all these different little alleyways so you have like a number of doors to choose from so let's go into this one and it leads into a room that's got like full of books and a sofa red and brown theme and then it's got lots of these uh, fashion designing um, tables then it goes into a kitchen with these lovely brown and uh, off-white uh, counters which actually I'd love to get but unfortunately I'm not actually at the level yet where you need to get them. They're really high, they're like probably the highest level you need to be at to be able to get them. Probably like 55 or something, I don't know. Um, so and then she's got some few uh, cookers and stuff and the uh, table for a toaster and of course the chopping table chopping board should I say and then there's outside she's got like a mixture of inside and outside of course depending on which door you go in and uh, she's got some uh, sleeping bags in the corner with some camping lights and then uh, you think you can go but you can't so you have to find which door leads to where okay so if we go into this part here and through this door into this other little corridor then it leads you into a room that's got that uh was it that magical bookcase as well and it's got like that brown tan um big sofa for many sims and it's got like a brown and like latin villa latin villa feel and uh it's got the orange tables and then obviously outside it's also got some bunnies and stuff as well but you can't actually get to them i don't think or oh, it's quite hard to get to them so anyway you've got this corridor here And then you've got this uh, toddler's like bicycle, which I know, again, another thing I never won. I think it was a timed uh, prize, which I didn't manage to get in the end when I was doing the toddler hobby ages ago. And there's this. And some stuff for the pets, like from your cats and stuff. And just some t tables for all your sims to eat at. Then there's some stairs. Then here is a little bathroom. It's all nice and blue. With blue sink and bath and shower and toilet and even blue mat, which actually is technically the uh, break dancers mat. So that's there. And then if you looked outside, you've got dog kennel, you've got the paddling pool, you've got um, trampoline, patio furniture, some barbecues and so it's a very big uh, patio that they've got here then I think that's all that there is uh, this the first floor or should I say ground floor then you can go down to the basement And here they've got this stereo that's got a huge, huge uh, speakers and brown, all like wood and brown furniture. And this old, old time looking telly, I was in, I think in the 60s or something. So even they've got these old computers, like it looks like one of the very first computers that you ever had. Well, not even that I ever had, but very old. And then of course the love chair, then a bed and a uh, wardrobe and also here you've got the picture side note 
now since the up baby update you can actually choose to put any picture that's been um, completed into your inventory and then you can either mount it and you know in build mode and put it somewhere afterwards on the wall or you can um just sell it i suppose for a few little simoleons so let me just take the paint in here and um yeah there's that and uh right so then let's go upstairs now and yeah through the bathroom and we can go through the bedroom entryway uh to well we could either go up to this lift here or we could have gone up the stairs on the other side so then it brings you to a, another bedroom which is sort of a boy looking bedroom with all bluey stuff with the blue like teenager bed and posters and books and stuff and then there's a, ni a nice uh, white bathroom just playing with you know the usual stuff and then it's got like a red mat underneath the uh, sinks and stuff. It just about fits. And then into another bedroom, which again is blue and uh, got all the teenage stuff in it for boys. And like the desks and stuff. And then let's see. Upstairs has got a lot of inside outside as well. Same as before. But uh, I can't seem to see a way to get to those chairs in the middle, like those recliner chairs. So, uh, yeah. Because, mm, yeah, <laughs> that, that little walkway doesn't lead to anything, so there needs to be a door put there. But uh, that's, I'm sure, for future reference. So we come back and uh, we've got this little corridor. It's just got lots of uh, flowers and that uh, pyramid sort of painting all along it. And then we get some more flowers. Then we go into like the sitting room. That's uh, where is she? okay yeah then we can finally go into the sitting room that's again got another love seat in it and a fireplace and more flowers from that came from the patio update so yeah i think that's pretty much the whole house uh let's see on the outside has it got anything there is yeah this patio here but it's got it's quite empty then on the other side there's also a patio as well, but there's not, not anything on it. And then of course the ones we did are downstairs and there's this one's got two reclining chairs on it and like a stereo and stuff. But other than that, I think it's quite an empty garden, but it's quite a big house anyway. Um, so yeah, I think that's the end of my uh, neighbor tour. If you'd like one, then uh, the details will be in the description below. Uh, otherwise, please like, comment and subscribe to this video. And uh, I'll see you soon.